guys so i wanted to show you guys where we are staying at in um gatlinburg pigeon forge i we still can't decide where we where we are at y'all we don't know if we on the gatlinburg side or the pigeon forge our phones say gatlinburg the people on the phone say pigeon forge we don't know but this is where we are staying <clears throat> the kind of i guess the name of this specific cabin is called the close beside me it is cabin number nine and this is the outside you guys it feels so good this morning it is just such a beautiful day as you guys could see they have like a little grill here where if you guys wanted to um you could barbecue make hot dogs hamburgers whatever they have a cute little flower and a flower pot and a couple trees here's the stairs i was very pleased you guys with how clean this cabin was so i actually got this cabin um through i saw in google i typed in pigeon forge cabins you guys and then this specific cabin is is by cabins for you so that's the company that it's called and then this specific cabin is cabin number nine and it's called the close beside me um cabin so let's go ahead and go in turn on some of these lights so this is the front door and this is the kitchen slash living room as you guys can see it is huge in here let me turn on some lights really quick so I can show you like a full detailed um oh you like them lights y'all aren't these cute so this is the fridge it comes with the dishwasher you guys it has a coffee pot it has the really deep sinks that I really really love and I love how the kitchen faces the front so that I'm able to see if you know people are coming to the door and stuff I love the little backlight right here and sorry guys this is like stuff that I brought from home like toilet paper cups plates um, trash bags hand sanitizer stuff like that dish soap they also have a toaster um, a can opener and a blender if you guys wanted to cook and stuff because you know I'm about to be in here throwing down knife set here is the microwave and the oven and i absolutely love it i love how open it is and i love how they stay true to obviously the cabin look but they still made it like a touch modern oh i didn't show you guys this isn't that cute okay so my boyfriend is in there there's the bathroom i'll show you guys the bathroom in just one sec. I feel like I'm going so fast. Okay, so this is the patio. Let me turn some more lights on. Ah, maybe that's it. Where's this light? There we go. Okay. So this is the living room. Has a nice flat screen. Nice good old fireplace that I love. So here's how the living room overlooks the kitchen. And then there's some stairs and a ceiling fan and some really cool lights. Aren't those so cute? That is really cute. And you guys, I was not expecting this cabin to be this big at all. It has so many windows. So let's go to the patio, which is probably my favorite part of the entire house. So this is a table, you guys, if you guys are, you know, having more than two or three people come with you and you wanted to make breakfast or something, you could have everybody sit here for breakfast or dinner. Um, but look at this view. So we did not get the cabin that came with the view of the Smokies, you guys. So we're kind of just like in the trees. Um, all of those cabins were like ridiculously priced and we just literally needed a cabin for like a couple days like we didn't need to get like a really big one because 
we knew that we were coming here with our kids and we didn't need like a big group of people with us. You know, some people come to Gatlinburg and Pigeon Forge with parties of 20 people. I mean, groups of 18, you know, we didn't, we didn't need all that. But what I do really like the fact is they have these little lights up here at night, you guys, they look so cool. I'll make another video at night so you guys could see how cool those lights look because all this is pitch black. There's not a single light. And then it's like all the little lights up here like give this so much. And it also has a ceiling fan up here, you guys. Like, so they have the ceiling fan and then they have another light here, but I really don't need it on because it's daytime. So we already seen the table. So they have, I mean, they have another um, table and chair, but it's just smaller. So this is for people who smoke and, you know, hang out and do stuff like that. Here's some rocking chairs and voila, the best part, the hot tub. Um, we're probably, I'm probably gonna clean it before we get in here, but as you can see, it looks nice, nice and clean already, but I'll just clean it up a little bit more just to make it up to my standard. And then we have our bug sprays out here. I have this ca uh, candle to kind of help keep stuff away. And then I have this backyard bug control spray, which I can spray in the air and it just keeps everything away, which is awesome. And then I still have this too. So yeah, shall we go look at the bedrooms? Hi. Hello. This is our bedroom. Guessing this is like the master. Comes with a nice flat screen. And then this is the bathroom. It's huge. Huge, huge, huge. Let me get some lights on. Dang, I can't get none of them on shit. Okay. So this is our bathroom. It's very spacious. Only one sink though, but very spacious. And I do love how this, <clears throat> our bathroom also faces the front. So we can hear if people are coming up here, if we hear any animals, you know, that's just better safety, I guess. I love this. Okay, so we looked at our bathroom. We looked at our room. And then our room faces So this is the upstairs. Another nice big window up here that faces the front. Okay, here's the second bathroom. As you can see, very big, very spacious. They give us lots of towels and washcloths. We are also, this bathroom is also facing the front. So as you're in here and you walk out, this is the view that you see. You get to see the kitchen, the living room. Okay. I guess you can call this like the loft, I guess. Probably come up here, kids can come over here, hang out, use iPads, play on their phones, whatever. Video games. I really like it. And then my kids are in here sleep. But I'm gonna show you their room anyway. Perfect size for kids. We got here at like two something yesterday, so everyone's still asleep. But that's it, you guys. That's the full tour of the cabin. I think I got everything. So they give Wi-Fi information and Bear Wise vacation tips. So this is the company through it's through cabins for you. They're very nice on the phone, very friendly. I would definitely recommend you guys renting through cabins for you. If you guys are interested in coming to Gatlinburg or Pigeon Forge, 
Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. You guys, they also have a washer and dryer as well as an iron. Um, this is definitely going to come in handy for people who are going to have dirty clothes and dirty swimsuits, stuff in general. We're at Ripley's Aquarium. Hey guys, so we are inside of Ripley's Aquarium of the Smokies. Thanks. Happy birthday, Ramil. Thanks. Happy birthday, Ramir. Thanks. And we're Thanks. here for the twins' Thanks. birthday. And we are looking at some really cool fish and an awesome waterfall in the tropical rainforest. And I have James here, Daddy James. And if you want to know who's down here. <gasps> oh, of course. I almost forgot. I almost forgot about Jemiah. Hi. Say hi. So we are here as a family exploring and checking out all these really cool things, you guys. So let's go ahead and get started. So now we are headed to Coral Reef. My phone is not the best right now. Ooh, these are seahorses! You guys want to take a look at what they got? Yeah. You see any seahorses? Let me know when you see one. Oh, I got one! Oh, how cute! And, and then here's some little random facts about seahorses. Now we are entering into the Shark Lagoon. Let's go. Come on. Your shoe fell. Okay. Look at that giant seashell. How cute. Oh my gosh. Oh, we were at the top. This is the bottom. Look at that big blue tail thing. Oh my god. Just look at the. Oh, there's a shark up there. Oh, it is. He went by. It was a smaller one. Look at those lights. You see him right here, James? Sorry. Even our voice sounds like echoing. Yeah. Look at the size of these. Oh my gosh. Guys, this is called a saltfish shark. Look at its face. It's smiling at me. Oh my gosh, that's creepy. <gasps> He's just up here chilling. I knew I seen something in the water up there. I kept saying that. I'm like, something is in the water, but it's shaped like a guitar. And it's him. Oh my gosh, that's creepy. They're all over here. It's like they know we're here. I just wanted to show you guys how high up we are. So 
definitely when you guys book this trip understand you're going to be really high up in the mountains so if you guys are scared of heights or narrow paths this may or may not be for you guys but as we go down on the hill and i mean the mountain i'm gonna show you guys how it looks okay we are right back Let me see your tricks. Go all the way down. Go all the way down. Come on, Ramir.
and they've already rolled a few other rides over here. I think it's a hot air balloon. And we are not doing the go-karts, but we have rolled some other rides and the slides over there. But they are having a ball. Hi, boys. So we are just in downtown Pigeon Forge, having some fun. Today is this beautiful lady's birthday. She is turning one years old. Yes, her name is Jemaya. Hi, birthday girl. Hi. How are you? How are you? You're so cute. Hi, James. Hi, Dad. So twins are just continuing to swing. We've got, I think, two more rides left. And then we are probably gonna go get some delicious barbecue. Look at that over here. Hello, Renee. tonight this is our last night I know I haven't done a whole lot of vlogging guys I've been trying really hard to vlog but I've been looking a mess and we've been having so much fun hi twins uh, it's so funny. what are you guys doing well, it's like you said. what are you doing Ramil talk to the phone not to me hi. this is for our YouTube channel Thanos what are you playing with? Awesome. So we're just chilling, getting ready to eat dinner. I will come back once it's all finished. Say bye, Jemaya.